Lee on six disturbing vandalism next to an Orange County school. Someone spray painted drug symbols near an elementary school in Ocoee. Tonight, with less than a week until school starts, police are getting results. News 6's Eric Von Anken is at Spring Lake Elementary with this exclusive story. And Eric, they've now painted this fence twice in just two weeks. And Ginger, they're about to paint it a third time, and they really don't want anyone vandalizing it again. Let me show you where we are here. So you see, this is the community behind me. Lots and lots of kids come Monday are going to take this trail and head to school just up there. Well, that's why on Saturday, police and church members are coming back to paint this fence. Now, like I said, a third time, they're going to put murals, beautiful murals, all over this so the kids see this instead and the message from police. Don't mess with that. This is the way that brothers Christian and Joseph walk to school. Right here, bad words and bad pictures. And this is where they saw things that elementary schoolers shouldn't be seeing. Disgusted. How come? Because all the bad words and all the bad pictures they put on there. This is the picture that Ocoee police are worried about right now, a graffiti tag that, of course, means prescription drugs. The symbol was sprayed up and down this fence at least 20 times after the first time it was painted. Definitely let me know that this is going to be a long process, that, that, that some, someone else ha has other uh, ideas uh, about what this, what this area should look like. Police want to find who did it. They posted this. We used uh, Facebook to go ahead and, and reach out to the community to see if anybody knew who was using this tag symbol. Ocoee's deputy police chief says it could be a reflection of the exploding opioid epidemic, or it's someone using the symbol just to mark territory. Either way... Well, this is the, the first and last thing they see when, when they go to school. The chief says children like Christian and Joseph and the hundreds of others who will take this fence-lined alleyway to school starting next week will no longer see it. Over the weekend, 200 members from High Point Church got results in just hours. They cleaned up the garbage, fixed the fence. So basically, you see these are new panels because this tree had pushed, pushed them back. And, and painted it a second time, this time blue. Why blue? Well, this is the Spring Lake Elementary's uh, symbol is the Blue Jays. The blue section actually starts just down there. Eventually, they're going to call this Blue Jay Trail. Right now, people refer to this as Pig Alley. The chief says they're going to put in video cameras, and if that still doesn't work, if the graffiti comes back, Matt and Lisa... They're going to start making arrests. All right, Eric, I like Blue Jay Trail a lot better. Thank you very much. But